people I'm back cooking again <clears throat> and today I'm doing sliced roast potatoes with a rack of lamb on top right as you can see I've just sprayed well you can't see well I have just sprayed some fry light in this in the uh, pan now I am slicing the potatoes a, pe a lot of people have been asking me to show them uh, show me peeling the potatoes thing is if I'm doing potatoes I do them early in the morning some more or less as soon as I get up and uh, well it'd be pointless showing you as soon as I get up isn't it really so I'm just showing you now me slicing the potatoes it's not really they're not really all the same but they're sliced and you wanted to see me slicing them, so slice them up. So I'm going to put, I'm going to put another few more in. I'm going to put that rack, rack of lamb in on a different tray because this will be covered with those potatoes. Right, as you as you saw, I was. I don't know. As you saw, I was slicing potatoes up. I'm going to put some fry light on. I don't know how much to put on. I'm just using, trying to use it up because apparently it's not good for you. Lord is. It's a scientist approved. Right, I hope you haven't seen it. But I'm going to show you now. Because I've just washed it. And look. Bless. A little wax alarm. Sorry. A little wax alarm. Right, that, well anyway, that's that's what I've been given from the butcher. I told him I want to rack a lamb, whether it's right or wrong. The butcher gave it me, so don't take it out on me. It's the butcher's fault. Right, I'm going to put it on a tray. Well, it's on a tray, and I've just put some fry light on it. And now I'm going to whack this in the oven. I'm going to give it half an hour on... 150. Can you please look at that cooker and tell me if it's 150? No, it doesn't matter if it's a bit higher. So call it about 180 then. Mm -hmm. Yeah, roughly about 180. I'm going to put it in for like, first I'm going to put it in for 20 minutes, check it, probably turn it over and then I'm going to, I'll show you it turning it over though. Right, as you can see, I've started turning the roast potatoes over. It's starting to feel lovely. They're not stuck, but I guarantee by the end of the day they will be. So I'm going to put a bit more of them fry light on that. And as you can see now, I've got the joint out. And I'm going to turn it over. turn it over and then I'm going to put that back in the oven for another half an hour and then I'm going to see how that's gone and see if it's done. I'm spraying some more sprit fry light on the roast potatoes if it's on the meat because as people have said, as scientists have said, it's not good for you. That you can see now it's done. I've cut a piece off because Lee's got to do the taste test. It's a bit pink there, isn't it? But, uh, so anyway, so yeah, that looks done to me. To you, Lee? Mm. Good. So I'll put that on plate and I'll get the roast taters and that. That's a point. Right, now I'm going to put some roast taters on, onto the plate with the. It was sliced roast potatoes with rack of lamb rib, rack of rib, lamb rib on top. And here is the end product of uh, sliced roast potatoes and rack of lamb ribs, or whatever it's called, rack of lamb. Now Lee's come to do the taste test. 
Right. Um, it can be done with pork if necessary. It can, it, well, it can be done without really. Right, let's try it. I've never tried um, Racco, is it Racco Lamb? Whatever. I've never tried it before so I don't know how it's going to taste. It's very bony. It, I know this is like people, but oh, here we go again. <laughs> but <laughs> it tastes like lamb. Well, it's a duck taste lamb. But it's not like normal lamb, if you get what I mean. It's like it's, it tastes of lamb, but it's more flavourly of lamb, if you get what ah, I mean. Yeah, well, so, there's different parts of lamb that makes it flavour. So it, 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 tastes, it tastes like lamb, but it's like more. Flavourly of lamb, if that makes any sense. Mm, I know what you mean, yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, you might know, I know, but they might not. Don't look at me like that. I'll look at you like that bloody one. Mm -hmm. Oh, <laughs> have a glove. I'm very close. <laughs> Just saw these fingers coming into my eyes. But, yeah, um, it's nice, flavourly, and, yeah. You know, I'll give it a bit more. Full of flavour, I think the word they're looking for. Ah, I don't know. Right, I hope I gave you a rough idea as to a rack of lamb. That's it. Rack of lamb, I got it. And sliced roast potatoes. I know they didn't always turn out sliced, but I did, you did see me slicing them and putting them in. Um, but the rack of lamb, yes, was done as well. So everything's done now. So if you like what you see, please keep. If you like what you see, please keep viewing me. If you want to give me a big old thumbs up, I'm much appreciated. And if you want to leave a comment, uh, now we've got the computer fixed, I can actually start adding, you know, approving some of them. And if you want to... I'll slap you if you do. And if you, if you want to leave your... If you want to subscribe, please feel free, the more the merrier. Please give over the eating while I'm on camera. <laughs> you put me off. If you want to subscribe, please feel free. The more the merrier. Thank you. Bye.